welcome to Day by Day Vlogs. This is my host Lily. I am Omaz and subscribe to my YouTube channel Omaz the Equestrian Girl. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Bye! It's already 11 a.m. Girls are just finishing homeschool. Sophie's done and Gabby's just finishing her reading. Because I finished my book. Yeah. So I only got to read for her. She only had to read for a few minutes because she finished a book. So tomorrow will be all about her book report. Um, she has got a bunch of schleich out on this table. Thumbs up to any of these schleich that, that were sent to us by people. Who sent us this one? Somebody? Subscriber? Yeah. Who sent us this one? Are all of these sent from a subscriber? Yep. Wow. Wow. Shout out to you guys because that's amazing. Isn't that no, amazing? No, that's the same person. Okay. So, in today's video, we are going to introduce you to our newest family member and tell you her name. And um, we are going to assemble the rest of the bunny hutch. Oh, yeah. Can I tell Yeah. Luna. It's Luna. No. The Kai. Luna. No. It's so funny because Gabby's my kid where I say to her when we're when I'm teaching her something new we'll look at the paper and she'll read it at the same time that I'm explaining it I'll say okay Gabby this is how you and she'll say oh got it this is how you do it I'm good go away and then she gets it and I'm like oh man I wish my brain worked like that Sophie's the kind of kid that has my brain where I teach her something and she's like that's just crazy I do not understand that and then I teach it to her again in a different way and she's like oh, what? And then I teach it to her again, another way, and she's like, oh, this is dumb. And then about three days later, she's like, what? why didn't you just say it this way? And she gets it. She just <laughs> needs a little bit of extra time, and then she gets it, and she masters it, and she's awesome at it. Today we were doing homophones, and I said to Sophie, okay, Sophie, a homophone is a word that spelled differently and means something different. And I said, can you tell me a homophone? And she, she said, oh, yeah. And then she told me a homophone. I almost fell off my chair. Gabby and I literally were like, <laughs> she actually just figured it out and knew it before we even learned it. It was amazing. All right, I'm going to give you guys the big reveal. And by big reveal, I mean it's just a small reveal because the whole thing's not done yet. But I want to show you guys what I've been working on and how it's kind of going to look when it's done. My idea is to have this all done by Saturday because um, all my kids and my grandkids are coming for Easter dinner on Saturday this year. So uh, basically, I've never been able to keep Lucky in a cage, ever. He always just gets out and he's not happy unless he's with the other bunnies. So, I, and he's happy just to lay beside their cage. So when it's finished, his cage is gonna be butted right up against the other bunnies cage so they can all live harmoniously. Anyway, uh, this is it, it's a bit small. I know that and it's going to change. It's going to be bigger eventually. Dun, dun, dun. So this is it. This yep, is his cage. Yep. I can't show you any other place in the room because the whole room is a big mess right now. Okay, so ah, that's not how you do it. So uh, this is his new bed. He's just got his but hay I and his food. How you open it. Just wait in his water and we are going to get him a bunch of other stuff to go in here. We're going to get him a different bed because that's not a very good bed. Um, because it's so small, not a lot will fit in there got a toy hanging there so he can't get out hopefully so but. how you open it is you lift this one up and you put that down and you can see your boy yeah so that's how we'll clean his, oh, come on. Come on. his cage and all that fun stuff careful careful with him careful he doesn't spill his water yeah so it's a lot hard to get him yeah so there you go there's your little boy. That's Lucky. That's Sophie's bunny. And that's his new cage. The other cage will be bigger. And will be close to, close to his. And it'll be bigger. Ella. This is Ella. The Lucky loves the babies. Whew, I am sweating buckets now. I have more wire stuff. Oh, he's so cute. Look at him smelling his bum. Don't crawl through there. 
Yeah, yeah the babies can yeah, crawl. Look it. Yeah, I don't know how it's gonna work with the babies because they could just crawl through that. Yeah, we might have to put okay, some stuff around the edges baby. for the babies. Like, yeah. Okay. So anyway, that's what it's gonna look like. Underneath, it's gonna have storage for baskets and stuff, which I'm super excited about. But it, there's it's a big work in progress, and I have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I really have two more days, and I have a lot of stuff going on right now. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go have lunch. All right, you guys, meet our newest family member, Luna. Luna. Uh, this is her. She is, a, I don't even know what she is. She's a black. She, the girls are freaking out because Sam drove her last night and he got her dirty because she was perfectly brand new, fresh, clean. I know. She's a. It's crazy. Stow and go. Is she a van or a minivan? She's a minivan. So this is her key fob. I love it. I love it. It's super cool because um, it's not even like a real key. Isn't that cool? All right, so here we go. So this is what it looks like when you come inside. It's got a black interior with the white walls. It smells like a brand new car in here. Can we let Ruby in? Yeah, in a second. So it's got the two little bucket seats in the middle and then the, the bench seat in the back. And it has got yeah, a the, TV. Yeah, the girl's favorite thing, right? So, just wait, is that officially your seat over there, yeah. Sophie? And then this is yeah, Gabby's seat? Yeah, this one, this Oh, this one, they've got more than two, they've got more than one this seat. This one in the back middle seat is my seat. Oh, okay. And this one in that back seat Oh, Ruby's seat. first time in. Don't let her up on the seat. I know. So the girls have little She's baskets here for their stuff. Yeah, and right there. Do you have like a drink holder or anything? Right there. Oh, okay. that's where I left my gloves. Okay, so they got a little drink holder on the side of the door there. Oh, watch Ruby, this. Love this. It smells so good in there. It smells like fresh laundry almost. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, Ruby. <laughs> Ruby's like, I'm, I'm going with you. Anyway, yesterday when Ruby. we bought this car, when I went to pick it up, or we were in there and I was trying to figure out how to turn on the Boy, heat. Ruby almost and got her head cut off. The guy literally came outside and he's like, "Your door's open," and he opened the door for me, or he closed the door for me, and then he's like. I'm like, do you know how to work the heat? And he's like, yeah, but they were laughing at me, I swear. They were laughing at me because I, I didn't gas. know how to get gas. I didn't know how to do anything. This is my drink holder and my stuff holder. And then I have a <coughs> another drink holder here. He goes in like this. And then turns on. This is the second minivan I've owned. I've only owned uh, three cars in my whole entire life. And this is the, the gear shift right here. It's up here instead of anywhere else, instead of down here. Another thing that's cool is that you got this screen here, has a backup camera, has all the radio stations. Plus you can put your memory stick here with movies and songs on it, which is super cool. But watch this. It comes right out so that you can put your DVD, whoops. So you can put your DVD right in there. Mom, I'm it also has hands-free calling, which I don't know how to work yet, but I'm gonna try and figure it out. Oh. Oh, wait, I don't have my phone. Stop, stop. I'm gonna look at my phone and try and see if I can hook it up. But anyway, that's it, this is our new van. It's super exciting, super fun. And basically, I'm gonna let Sam drive it as much as he wants. As long as he's driving, I'm happy. Um, this is for when Sam's not here and I need to drive places. We need to get a razor, no. Shave these whiskers. Like, these are, let me see if I can get them. Look at the whiskers on this girl. Wait, let me go on this side. Look at the whiskers. Do you have a Maybe razor? Spencer's. And look at Spencer's. Spencer's. Yeah, Spencer's got whiskers too. Got long ones too. Not that one. She has long ones. Mom, you can't. She is a pretty horse you can't though. Touch her she won't allow you. I don't know what happened to her hair. She has <laughs> her forelock. Her forelock. It just, just looks weird to me. She's like, Mom, I had a bad haircut. Don't point it out. Mom, Let me do her. Oh. She has a beautiful mane, that's why. I know. Oh. Yeah. So are you riding ja are you riding this horse? Yeah. Yeah, first. Oh, so you're not riding you're Jasmine? Yeah. Is it so, is it because you mastered Jasmine last week? I don't know, probably. 
No, probably because Michaela. Oh yeah. And she doesn't want to make us go down. Oh. Well, that's something new. Uh, Gabby wasn't. Gabby was supposed to ride Jasmine, but I'm bet you she's happy to be riding Sabrina. You know what's really weird is that the other day Gabby said, "You know, I only have a few short rides left on Sabrina before she leaves," and now that's really true because soon she's gonna have her own horse. This looks amazing on him. Let's see. Do it. Gentle, gentle. She's Louise. It's nice. Worried you blow my reputation But the figure is not on me Yeah, yeah, yeah The way you're making me show me your hands on myself I keep pulling the trigger, alright This very finger for people like them Oh, no, no Well, darling, oh, my, my I'm feeling so fly up in the zone now I'm like a golden crown world and high Push on. Go large. Come 
Okay, finish your circle and then go large. Go around the whole arena. Go through. Drop those heels down, lock those legs on. <laughs> What'd she say? In the western side was so much easier. Because your legs are straighter and not on your horse's belly. Spin your legs, feet. Circle. Spiral your body and stand up taller. It's actually going fast, though. Oh, it took his whip. Six months later, we got one. <laughs> Grow taller, get that booty out of that saddle. I don't want to see a touch. Good. Come up the rail. Come up the rail. Use the whole arena. You're going to do a circle at the letter B. Right there. Circle. You're going to circle the middle of the arena. Not going to the rail. Just circle the middle. And turn. Go down the rail a little bit. And turn, 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 yeah. So we're cutting the ends off. So that looks like nothing. But the amount of balance you need. I'm tired of people at the end. It's so hard. And walk. Good. Circle. 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 You have to go way into the corner before you go across the deck. It'll make you no corner cutting. So go right into the corner. Almost to the orange triangle. Now turn. Yeah, same thing on that end. Hit the rail and then go into the corner. Change, yeah. Better. So stay on the rail a little bit longer this time. Stay out there, stay out there, and turn. Much better. Leg yield over. We missed that whole corner, Missy. You gotta think about your entrance and your exit. Nice exit. Now think about your entrance on the other side. You have to get the whole corner. Leg yield are over. Push, push, push. There. Change your rising. That was perfect. Same thing down here. Do a little light spot. There's two of them on the wall. See the two light spots? The low one. Aim for the low one. Beautiful. Come up to the center line. You're going to halt at X, which is the center of the arena. Nope, so do it again, go down. Change your right. You're gonna come off the center of the arena. You're gonna hold at X. X is the center of the ring completely. Cause you're the only thing that I can't lose. I never needed you to give me things. I never needed you to dive in.